Hey there, everyone, this is Elf and Ghost Trick. Tricking ghosts. Things are happening a lot these days. Yeah, that's where we are. Whoa, we're past 4 a.m. Time is advancing very quickly in this story. Yeah, last time we ended that chapter end. Uh, yeah. The phone rang. So we got two hours left in our murder mystery zone. Lots of supernatural stuff is happening. Blue-skinned foreigners, the Smurf Nation, will rise up from their subs. Uh, submarine sandwiches. Oh, was that bird listening in on a call? Maybe. Okay, well, we gotta trace the control room. Wait. Is that already a place? I don't know, that's weird. Now he's looking at me directly. <laughs> now, to be fair, it has been established that ghosts just perceive the game from a 2D plane like this. It's just kind of really funny. Alright, well, we're going there. We're gonna find some answer. Yeah, so Lin went to a place and made a call to bring us at this place. Where we want to be. Other oh, says so. The single line spread out like a spider web and start to fate of many people. It's sub time. Wait, how did that happen? The sub network. Whoa! It disconnected from the internet at the bottom of the ocean. Like that's how the internet works. There's just like giant like spools of rope of wires, and uh, sharks eat them. Yo, Noah. How'd you manage to get here, Joyd? Uh, that's pretty impressive. <laughs> it even says this man, it's even taller than me. Weird. Yeah, yeah, yes, it wasn't, it was him. He got here, he called us, and we're here. We, we had a connection for here before, though, so that wasn't super necessary, now that I think about it. I don't know. Well, he had to establish the call to have it connected to the phone network, because we saw that, like, otherwise it's not. So, yeah, because the, the, the sub went. Right, right, of course. What? Well, some Marines are cool, and they have an extremely high mortality rate. That's not cool. Uh huh. Okay. <laughs> Wait, how does that work? Did did Flesh Cecil say anything? I guess we're gonna find out. What? Oh, wow. Okay. Sure. <laughs> oh, and the clock. Okay. Wow. They've been planning this for a while, huh? I don't know. Can I believe it? Does my sense of of uh, disbelief is able to withstand that? I choose yes because it's fun and entertaining. It's just it's just kind of out of nowhere. Like it's a little bit of a weird haha. -ha! There's no way you could have guessed this kind of thing. But whatever, it's fine. It's fine. Honestly, it's minor enough that I'm totally okay with it. Hmm? Well, that man has a red X. Well, he has two. I guess that's just a uniform. Button, button. Button and slap. Slap the... Hey, he's right here all this time. Man, your, your detective sense. Not doing great. Oh, it's just his corpse, though. Okay. Oh. Well, that's kind of terrible. So they are just keeping his body around. So, I mean, that would explain- so, I've been silently, personally wondering, like, how is the bot like, if the body is dead, who's maintaining it? Like, why haven't it start to rot and stuff? But if it's being actually used by these people, then they would maintain it, they would keep it clean, they would keep it... fed? Like, I know there's stuff you can do to a body so that it remains like it looks good, but for ten years, though... Well, maybe with some form of medicine, maybe? 
Hmm. I'm more concerned about that than the discussion here, and that feels bad. I'm more interested, I feel like, by the... Supernatural elements of the story than, like, the political ones. Like the... The human concerns, if you will. I thought I was meant for a trap for Joy, but because he's so big, he just didn't fall, but no. Oh, the meteor. Oh, right. They just want him for that. And now they have it. Whoop, wow, that's just... Well, all right, then. Flop, there we go. That thing, that chunk is huge. That is the size of an organ. Wow. Welp. <laughs> Derek Joy, I feel you should be a bit more aware of what's happening. I thought he was a bit more on the money. Either that or the writer of this series really loves shocked moments. And well, I don't know what's going on here, but <laughs> okay. Magic sub straight out of the Mega Man. He, he went with a room. Were you not paying attention? Oh, am I having to watch? Is that a basketball in the hammock? Well, no more light. Yeah, and there's a baseball in the other one. This is the sports zone of the sub. Alright, well, that took a turn for the weird. Uh, I'm here! I'm the phone in the thing. Oh, there's a certain doggo. Alright, let's, let's have a talk. It's worth that. Hey, why are you here, missile? Uh, oh, it's a missile theme. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, why not? Oh, yeah, you don't have a ghost nose. I wonder if it'd be more convenient to explore using a certain dog. Oh, well, there's the intraphone. That might be good. Wow! <laughs> Woobity woof. Alright, so I feel like exploring as Quincy the dog would be easier because he can just like go all over the place. Like, like that. He can even go here. Oh, I wonder. Well, I can't go here, but I might be able to do that. It's like, I wonder, can I swap when he's part of the... Uh... Alright, if you're not gonna be convenient, I can do that. I can say I want to swap, but you're not gonna let me. That's what I was wondering. So I can't swap when um, Cecil's in it. Alright, well... Yeah, yeah, there's that bell. There you go. On the phone. Hello, hello! <laughs> Excited puppy. Hmm. The black hello box. Well, that's easy for you to say. So, how do I create a path here while just being able to swap things? Because, like, yeah, I can swap this all day long, but that doesn't matter. I find this guy to be very impractical sometimes. Uh, just, just, no, just go, okay, you know what, I'll put you there. Alright. Like, emergency light can't do anything with that. And telephone, like, I can't do anything with any of the objects here. Um, is there anything I'm missing anywhere? Like a small ball. Valve. Anything on top? No. I, what am I miss? Okay, well, okay, there's the possibility that... No, I'm gonna... Okay. Calm down. Since I'm so limited in options, let's do this swap. Because that's like the only thing that makes sense. Okay, that does that. Fascinating. Does that matter? 
Okay, but I can go there now. Um, so I'm just gonna put you here to not be in the way. It's like, that's the biggest puzzle I find, is that stuff get in the way. Like, because they can't share the same posts. Alright, so then we can swap that. And the weight difference is good. Yeah, 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 no, I... Am I too late? Okay, whatever. Yeah, the phone is on hook. Maybe that means we can just go anytime. Yeah, okay, well, I'm trying, but it's hard to do anything fast. Alright, here we go. That was time, though. Like, there's never... Like, that was a time thing. That was supposed to happen. Camilla not having a good time. Time, time, bad time, good time. Hey! Okay, she can't hear you. Okay. Lynn is... Uh-oh. Lynn is... Alright, let's go. No, 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 we're going. There's no reasons to stay here, as far as I can tell. Oh, yeah, that's, uh... That's the swimming Lynn right there. Just, that's a very subtle style that is banned from most competitive environments. I mean, like, you can't really just get sad because we know what's gonna happen. We know what this means. <laughs> oh, maybe, maybe. Okay, no, that's us. Because he looks so serious, I thought it was a controller. Because he's surround. Yeah, he said he was hanging out in her. So where, where is a controller then? Is he faking? Is this a trap? I don't know. I wonder what missile sounds like. Spe like, is it just like how a Pomerian barks, but making human words? Uh, Like, like, take that little yip, and now imagine that yip said, I'm so glad I was born your little doggy. It'd be hard to take Missile seriously, unfortunately. It's too bad, it's a really good boy, but that's just, that's just a reality. I appreciate it. I prefer I prefer to gameplay solo Cecil. I, I I I I enjoy the swapping, but I like the purity of just jiggle things around puzzles. It'll do it. Although this I feel like they could still like team up, like there is no real reason to split up, honestly. But oh I can Hey, let's have a chat. Maybe she has something cool to say. That would be fun to know. Oh, well... Her whole knowledge base will be from the point of view of a luggage. <laughs> that you manage to sleep in this situation is... impressive. Mm-hmm. Uh, at least he got get he got you a cot and everything. Like it's re looks reasonably comfortable. It's better than the floor. And then Lynn showed up on this. Everyone just boarding subs. Don't worry about it. We found a secret path. I mean, knowing this game, they might actually explain it somewhere. Alright, that was cute. I'm glad that happened. Alright, missiles hanging up there. Oh, I need a- I need a turn, turn, turn! Woo! Alright. Talking with Lynn's torso. That's where her core is. It's the core. It's in the middle. You never know anything. Hmm. Maybe she got bopped on the head. Yeah, it's, you know, it's a sub made out of precise compartments. 
Okay, yeah, so follow, try him that radio transmitter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Took a boat out of the sea from us. Okay, so took a little dinghy or a little speedboat, a little room room. Okay, so it was a bit more than a dinghy then. It was like a ferry, maybe. All right, fair enough. See, I I, exa I said, oh, the game's probably gonna explain it, and they did. They cannot leave anything unexplained in this game. Is the reality? See, look at that. They're explaining everything. Like, there's not a ton of personnel in this sub, so I can kind of believe that they'd be able to sneak around. But it's like super hard to sneak in the sub. Like, there's just echoes everywhere. Everything is metal. Alright, yeah, that does sound like she got bombed in the head. Or it could have been the controller. Like, remember, he was in Mabbit and Camilla, and then he would have spotted her happening. So, yeah, he could have ghosted something to bop her. Alright, we're gonna look at the murder, but we're gonna leave the puzzle for next time. But let's rewind time for now and see what happened. This is how I like to divide things up. Alright. The S, you know, I don't think it's a pun or anything. So lens here. Yeah, but, you know. Look at that. Yeah! Oh, man! Violence, Camilla! Unfortunately, like, you're using small girl muscles, so... Oh, man. This is pretty well done, honestly. I'm not sure how you recognize the like the voice. I guess just from the words used. Phone. Phone. <laughs> wow. Oh jeez. Ah, oh, the animation was real nice. I'm not sure why. <laughs> She's raising her arms out of habit, but like, I don't think that would stop someone who is specifically trying to shoot you. <laughs> Everything's going down the drain. Man, getting you, uh... I'd make a reference to my comic that no one's aware of, so I guess I won't. Because it's a reference that would just not mean anything. I see, so waiting in her, yeah, 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 but the wrong person came up. Yeah, that would have been messed up. Never heard of it. This revenge thing, preposterous idea. And, okay, so that's the room leaving, probably. Okay. Oh, he probably left because he's uh, he's gonna go after the... Wow! Huh. Well, yeah, that's fair. <laughs> I mean... I have to agree. Uh, Flesh Cecil can't just be a bundle of id because, boy howdy, is he planning things. Uh, it was pointed out that why the ten year time span until then? And I honestly, I have no clue for that. Like, why it took so long for this whole revenge thing to happen? Like, this whole plan to, like, culminate. <laughs> All right, well, next time, we're gonna save Lin again, uh, in theory. All right, we're just gonna go in ledger mode because, you know, time is relative and sometimes, but not always, exists.